It's beer o'clock on Real Ale Craft Beer. Today we've got a beer from Brewery Van Steenberg in Belgium. And this is a bottle of the Golden Drac Brewmaster. It's coming in at 10.5% ABV in a 330 milliliter bottle. Of course, you can see the Golden Dragon it means golden dragon in English. There's the bottle cap. Now, if you want to find some golden drac at this very moment in time, you can pick it up, especially this one, the Brewmaster series. A little bit of smoke on the bottle opening. At Beers of Europe, .co.uk. Beers of Europe, the largest online beer store with a fantastic range of beer from all over the world. Really is a terrific, terrific website. I'll talk to you a little bit more about that in a moment, but I, first of all, I want to show you the beer. We got a one finger, slightly off white head, but the beer in the glass it almost looks like a cherry red colour. Look at that fantastic, fantastic liquid in the glass. You can almost see that wonderful mouthfeel. Bottle conditioned beer, but there's not much in the way of sediment there in the bottom of the glass. It's slightly unfiltered though, to look at. But look at that beautiful lace in the carbonation. The beer looks great. So beers of Europe, yeah, you can pick beers up from America and Belgium and Spain and Portugal and France and all over the world, really. Argentina. There's some great beers out there, especially from beersofeurope.co.uk. There's a link in the description box of the video for their website. Check it out. But the other place, the other place you can find some golden drac at this very moment end of August, early September, will be your local Lidl. They have the little boxes of Belgian beers for about £11. And normally there's one or two bottles of Golden Drac at 10.5% ABV. Not the Brewmaster, but the regular Gold, I say regular, is 10.5% ABV. on their shelves in Lidl. Go and have a look at it. Right, so let's get the aroma on this beer then. Ooh. Wow. Unbelievable, unbelievable. You can, you, I, I said you can probably look at the body, you can see the body of the beer in the glass, but you can almost smell it as well. That aroma is giving off a lot of a lot of flavour, a lot of aroma. It's that classic kind of Belgian candied sugar. But at the same time, I think they've used some new world hops in here. It smells The aroma is of mixed fruit jam. It smells fantastic, really fantastic. Sweet, slightly spicy and peppery. The aromas coming out the glass is just fantastic. Let's dive in. Cheers, everybody. Stone the Crows. Stone the Crows. That is some beer. There is no 
suggestion whatsoever, none whatsoever of that 10.5% ABV. There's no alcohol burn. There's no real taste of alcohol at all. It's just pure flavour, malt, biscuitiness, sweetness from the malt, that kind of Belgian candy sugar galore flavour coming through. Peppery, spicy, hoppy, dry. There's that classic Belgian dryness coming through. It's fabulous. It really is fabulous. So on the website, beersofeurope.co.uk, you can either buy a 750 milliliter bottle of this at 10.5% ABV. And there's your Saturday night right there, isn't it? You know? If you're a fan of these big beers, there's your Saturday night movie night sat in front of the telly watching your favourite film with a 750 milliliter bottle cork and cage of, of, of this golden draft brewmaster. That's on Beers of Europe's website. I suggest, I, I went for the small bottle on their website because, it, you know, I'm just reviewing it, but... But I could, I could honestly see myself and I, I often I often talk about where would I drink this beer? How would I drink it? Where would I drink it? Would it be with a barbecue? Would it be? No, no, no barbecue with this one. No barbecue whatsoever with this one. This one is all about the colder nights, the darker nights, shut the curtains, put on your loungewear. Whatever you wear, <laughs> your spandex if you're into <laughs> and, and just sit in front of them, put your favourite movie on, maybe light the fire, put the central heating on and just sit there all cosy with a, with a nice big bottle of premium quality Belgian ale. That's the way to do it. That's where I can see myself drinking this beer. It's absolutely superb. absolutely superb the drinkability that kind of that lovely kind of slightly kind of rich mouthfeel coming through but the, the wonderful 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 mixed fruit jam flavors that i'm getting now as i mentioned golden drac there's three different varieties of golden drac golden drac now i often find the regular bottles of Golden Drac, I say, but again, I say regular, it's 10.5% ABV. They're quite dry. They're quite dry beers. They kind of leave you like, you can, you can almost kind of like, oh, you know, this one's 10.5% ABV. There's a bit of a kick to this. But you're not getting that in this. You're really not getting any suggestion at all of that 10.5% ABV. Brilliant beer. Really, really brilliant beer. Crafted as a tribute to the godfather of Jeff Versell, sixth generation brewmaster. It combines modern brewing technology with traditional craftsmanship. Extra strong Belgian beer with fermentation. Um, and that's really a brewed and bottled by, of course, Brewery Van Steenberg, fantastic brewery there in Belgium. Let's rate it. Let us rate this beer. Look at that. Look at that. Looks good. Smells good. Tastes out of this world. It really does. That for me is a Stone the Crows 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10 beer from Real Ale Craft Beer. Please put your comments in the comments box. Subscribe to our daily beer and food reviews. Give us a big fat thumbs up. Boom. Cheers.